Welcome to Lou Allen Galleries and one of the most exciting events of the 2019 season. We're extraordinarily honored to be presenting a 50-year survey of the nationally acclaimed artist Forrest Moses, considered one of the finest abstract contemporary landscape artists in the United States. Forrest is celebrating his 85th birthday this year, and we are honored to present Forrest Moses' personal collection, as well as the collection of Charles McKay and Cam McCleskey. Charles was the director of the Santa Fe Opera and has recently retired, and so we're fortunate enough to be presenting his collection as well. This collection captures early works from 1969 to 2012, which was the last year that Forrest painted. When I'm putting together a show, it's usually of a, of a particular period of time, and there is a beginning and an end to that time. And it, it moves from one idea to the last piece that you do. And, it, and when, by the time you get to the end of that time, they may be very different from where you started. Forrest moved to Santa Fe in 1969. He was taken with the beautiful, natural environment of New Mexico and the incredible light and color. The paintings span not only New Mexico, but the wetlands of Virginia, the northern regions of Connecticut. His intellectual approach to painting has created throughout the years phenomenal dimensions in color and composition. Within each painting, there's a, a vocabulary, and color is one of the voices of a painting. Line, a value, a shape, form, these are all part of the vocabulary of a painting. In the 1950s, Forrest was in the Navy and had the opportunity to work and spend time in Japan. He was heavily influenced by the aesthetics of the Japanese approach to nature. Collectors and museums from all over the United States come to view forest monotypes. They're considered some of the finest in the United States, and people look at him for direction. One of the interesting things about it is, since I do work from photographs, it's a way to isolate and reduce an image to its essentials because in monotype you have to think of it almost as a sketch. You can make a beautiful complete image with it but it, it lends itself to reduction to essentials, the essential vocabulary of an idea. Very often <clears throat> the monotypes inspire the paintings. Santa Fe was like a sanctuary a place to think and explore the mountains and there was so much. There was the western landscape which was all about mesas and arroyas and then there was the mountains with streams and there were lakes and there was everything you could possibly want was right here. In the process of learning the craft, I think I became an artist. I've always said you cannot call yourself an artist. That's a, an honorary title that's given to you by other people. But it's not something that you say about yourself. You say, I'm a painter, I'm a sculptor, I, you know, I do different things. The craft comes from the mind, but the art comes from the heart. Thank you for joining us here at Lou Allen Galleries and again for one of the most exciting and innovative shows of our 2019 season. We're looking forward to seeing you at the gallery soon. If you need or require additional information, please contact us at Lou Allen.